I'm Chris Trott from Team TaylorMade here at Liberty National, the Northern Trust, with an iconic view behind me and also an iconic golf bag. I'm joined by the owner of this golf bag, Mr. Sergio Garcia, who's gonna take us through all the shots. Let's start out with an easy one for you, off the tee box. 95 yards down, Breeze? Really nice par three. I think you can handle it with the new 60. Yeah. You ready? Okay, here comes a good one. Love that. That one was nice. The most important thing at the end of the day is, is committing to whatever shot you want to hit and trusting it. Sometimes it can be tricky and you get caught up between two or three different shots. Because if you do that, there's always going to be doubts and, and you're not going to be as smooth as if you're really committing to one shot. I've always been uh, quite creative about it and, and try to imagine different kinds of shots that we can hit. I enjoy the challenge of seeing a shot and, and playing it differently than, than, you know, a lot of people might see it. This shot, as perhaps simple as it might be for many people, it's really not. I mean, it's tight. How do you see it? I can show you two different ways to play it with the same club, uh, with, a, with a 58. One, obviously, would be kind of throw it up a little bit in the air, bounce it on the green and spin it. The next one I can probably hit maybe a little more like a close face, little maybe a little draw, bouncing it short and making it release to get all the way to the hole. Let's move into a trap so we can see you out of that. Mill grind three wedges, new to you. What drew you towards them? At the end of the day, for me, it's just uh, it comes down to looks. You know, if it looks good and it feels good then I feel like I can do anything I want with it. If I feel like it's coming off the face nicely, like I can feel the ball in the club face, then it's easy. When you get into a bunker and you've got a shot like this, will you try to spin bunker shots more often or will you run them out more often? I'm more of a hit hard with spin kind of bunker player. I'm more of a open face, hit hard, fly close to the flag and, and spin it. There you go. When you have uh, wedges like the mill grind three, you have the trust and, and, and the belief in them that if you do it properly, the ball is going to come out exactly like you want it. Confidence makes you hit better shots. OK, look, I've put you in a tough spot here, but partly I want to see this shot going towards that backdrop. I know it's not really on the fair side, but how do you gauge how deep this rough is and how steep to get into this shot, first of all? Um, yeah, I mean, this is a tough shot, obviously. Downhill, high grass, bunker, a little bit downhill. So it's, it's a shot that two out of 10 that you're gonna hit inside probably five or six feet. So you're gonna try to feel a little bit how the grass is reacting when you go through and and then try to, uh, depending on how much it grabs or not, uh, hit it a bit harder or, or a bit softer as you go through it. Pretty ridiculous. That was a pretty good chip, by the way. 